Hey everybody, Ogre here again for Ogre Breaks, doing another box opening. I have one of the World's Greatest Card Chase Pack Edition. These are six baseball card packs uh, featuring favorite players in the past 30 years of in unopened baseball cards packs. Uh, these are usually products that I normally don't open regularly just because usually what's inside isn't anything great. Uh, a lot of junk wax era usually stuff like that so i figured i'd open up a box i did order this from the target website uh almost two weeks ago and I, it only came in the mail uh, i was really planning on doing this video a little earlier but since you know i ordered it got it i figured i'd still do the video there is some other big finds i guess you can find where you get uh, randomly inserted diamond packs um redeemable for super star rookie cards and i guess there's things with jer uh, jerseys or autograph memorabilia I, I have absolutely zero hope of pulling anything like that out of this uh these were 20 dollars on the target website i know they did appear in stores as well um they i could not find any in a store near me so i figure i'll open one up so you guys can kind of see what it is the you know hopefully keep you guys from you know purchasing these really in my opinion um so yeah empty box doesn't look like anything crazy memorabilia wise unless something in here in between packs and no so uh so we got 92 Fleer ultra Fleer ultra was always a um a brand that i like growing up we have Team Best Signature Series 1998 Top Prospects. Um, okay, not something I remember at all. We have Donruss Baseball. Uh, this uh, from 1988. Another Donruss Baseball from 89. One of the uh, Nolan Ryan packs, which actually I remember these cards actually. Uh, Texas Express uh, Trading Card Series by Pacific. And then 1990 Upper Deck uh, Baseball. Uh, hit the Find the Reggie uh, numbered series. So um, let's do the Nolan Ryan one just to get that one out of the way. This was, um, I, I think it was like maybe a, I don't know, 100 card set. Basically just all Nolan Ryan cards. Um, I, I remember the cards vaguely. I don't remember them. I, I couldn't tell you even the last time I even looked at any of these cards. I know I had some growing up, but, uh, so we got Nolan Ryan, Tension of a Pennant Race. Maybe it's with the Mets. Uh, card for no-hitter number four. Sweet six, probably meaning his sixth, um, uh, no-hitter, excuse me. So, you know, some of them, you know, back of the card has just like a picture. Some of them, you know, a little bit of a note from um, the game. Here's like the box score or the pitching line, especially for his one no hitter. Uh, fastball grip, just kind of showing off his grip. Real special moment. Uh, slow start with the Mets. Greatest moments, 1989. 300. Uh, win ba uh, battery, Armsbury, Ryan, and uh, Petrelli. Very good workout. Astros win the Western Division title, signed by the Mets, and Nolan Heat. So it's, I mean, Nolan Ryan was a pitcher that I liked growing up. So they were kind of fun when I was a kid and, you know, kind of looking at them. Um, so, yeah, they were kind of fun, but. I don't think there's really any value to them at all. But all right, let's go to these Team Best Signature Series 1998. I'm actually kind of curious what these are. Um, so let's see, this is something I don't remember. So all right, so you got Scott Krause for the Redberg, Redbergs, Redbirds, excuse me, can't speak. Uh, Brewers prospect at the time, Chris Hermanson, Brent Butler, we got team best. Uh, okay, there's just a mail in thing. <laughs> so, mail in to uh, and send in uh, $49.99. Um, 
if you want to mail in for a Carrie Wood uh, autographed card. I'm assuming all for good while supplies last. So, uh, all right, well, Jimmy Rollins, decent name there. Julio Ramirez and Gil Mache. So, I mean, the Jimmy Rollins definitely for the Clearwater Phillies at the time. So, um, all right, let's, uh, let's do the 88 Don Russ, see what we get. Uh, this is one of the puzzle pieces for Stan Usual. So here we go. Willie Randolph, Pat Tabler, Craig Reynolds, Mike Moore, uh, Jose Uvery, Mark Grace, rated rookie. Okay, decent name. Lance Johnson, rated rookie. Alan Trammell, uh, MVP. Jeff Blauser, Eric Plunk, Cal Daniels, Al Preek, Mike Marshall, Bo Jackson and Gary Pettis. So actually some okay cards out of that pack, actually. Um, for you know what it is with being, you know, 88 uh Donruss. Uh then we got uh 89 Donruss. See what we got here. And I'll be honest with you, some of my years with uh certain rookies, I honestly don't really remember. Uh so we got the Warren Spawn puzzle pieces there. And here we go. John Trudor, Bud Black, Pat Taylor, Dave Hernandez, Tracy Jones, Pete O'Brien, Daryl Strawberry, MVP card. Okay. Mark Clear, Walt Trail, Bob Stanley, Hal Morris, Mike Soroka, Scott Bailey's, Luis. De Los Santos and Bob Welsh. So nothing too crazy there. All right, let's do the Upper Deck 1990. Now, I have opened up some Upper Deck not too long ago. It's been a little while, but um, I think it was 91 maybe. Actually, no, these are actually these are, these did not brick. The Fleer Ultra probably will be a uh, brick though for sure. But Oil Can Boyd. Then we have Ton, Todd Benninger. We got Ron Oyster. We got Mike Harkey. Carlton Fisk. Not a bad name there. Greg Hibbard. Jeff Innes. New York Mets. Recently uh, actually passed away as well. Uh, Padre sticker, Red Sox sticker. Actually, there's like two stickers there. Yeah, Astros sticker, a couple of stickers. Jim Gott, Dan Pete Plaska, Pete Incabilia, excuse me. Then we got John Smiley, Randy Bush, Carlos Quintana, Jamie Moore, and Lance Blankenship. To finish off that pack. So, all right, clear ultra. See what we get. Like I said, this box is twenty dollars at Target. And it's six random packs. So you have a chance for inserts, but you know, definitely very tough to pull anything in this. And yeah, just kind of what I expected. These are kind of a brick. But we do start off with the Ivan Rodriguez rookie card. So that's not bad. Jay Buner. Uh, you gotta be very careful with these with the brick. Pat Borders. I know sometimes you can stick the pack in the freezer and that'll help. But George Bell. We got Daryl Kyle, rookie. A couple of rookie cards. Tim Burke. We got Kurt Schilling. Terry Shumpert. Melendo Perez. Mike Fielder. Ozzy Smith, okay. Barry Bonds, Fred McGriff, Chuck Finley, and yeah, that will do it actually. So, I mean, realistically, there was some decent names pulled out of those packs. No real, you know, superstars. Pudge, nice card to pull though. You know, it's a it's a rookie card. I'll you know kind of keep off to the side personally, just because uh, he was a player that I did I did like a lot personally. Um, but anyway, with that, you know, let me know what you think about this box. Um, 
you know, the, uh, the world's greatest card chase. Like I said, this is one of those things I'll buy one box, do a video for, and pretty much I'm only buying the box so you guys can, you know, see what you get out of this product. Not a product that I will rec recommend for sure. Um, but you know, let me know, you know, if, in the comments, if you did open any of these, did you pull anything, you know, worthwhile? Um, or was it just a complete waste? Um, pretty much like I was, ex I was like, I was walking into, you know, when I did this video. Um, so appreciate to hear, I'll hear from you guys. If you've opened them, pull anything decent out of them, you know, leave a like on the video though. If you greatly, you know, appreciate if you, if you like the video, greatly appreciate it. If you do, uh, helps out the channel, a big deal. And, uh, if you haven't subscribed, if you're new to the channel, greatly appreciate if you subscribe. Um, you know, hit that notification bell for any of my future uploads. And with that, I want to thank you guys again for watching. Have a great night.